love cameras, but there's one thing I love more. It's what's in this box. Smooth. Fresh. This is the new flagship one wheel, the GT. This is the beefiest one wheel they've ever made. This is the Pint X, this is the GT. This is the old flagship one wheel. Actually, Actually they kind of look bigger. they kind of look the same. <laughs> this one is a little bit bigger, I think. These are concaved, so you could in the past get these these extra pads to make it concave. This comes stock concave and it's concave on the front, whereas this one was not. I think that's actually gonna be a big deal. To you, this probably means nothing, but as long as there's grip. <laughs> One thing I have to say right away, I love that this has a front handle here, but also the side handle. Every once in a while, your one wheel dies, you run out of battery and you have to carry it, or if you just need to carry it for whatever reason, this is much easier. But if you are to bring it upstairs sometimes, or you wanna get on the stand, it's so much easier putting it up against the wall like that versus trying to do this, this like. <laughs> Horizontal? Just who carries something horizontal? Seriously, that's my one complaint about the Pint X. It doesn't have like a pick this up and put it up against the wall. You have to do it like this. Not ideal. This is great still. First world problems. First world problems. First world one wheel problems. I can't put my one wheel <laughs> up against the wall. <laughs> You know how I uh, said I was gonna hire somebody and one of the requirements was for them to ride a one wheel? This is Isaac. He's hired temporarily at least. He's just gonna find out if I lied on my application or I didn't. So right. this is the test if you <laughs> they're gonna get exposed today. All right, let's see what this thing can do and more importantly, what Isaac can do. Not much. Okay, maiden voyage. Why do I feel a little nervous? Because it's I've cold. Done this, I've done this so many times. All right, here goes nothing. Ooh. Right away, it feels very different. What, did they change, they changed something, I think. You barely, I don't know if it's just a stronger motor, but right away, it feels very different. All right, let's see what it can do. I would say it feels really smooth and really good. And One Wheel has always had really good, like their software has been on point. This also feels a little scary. It's fast. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Right away, you feel a difference. I don't know if it's just the motors are strong. <laughs> They're stronger. You don't feel the motors like really kicking in. Like on the XR, you feel it like, okay, now the motor is engaged. Whereas this is just, just smooth. And the acceleration is like, now I feel like I need to wear a helmet. Normally I don't ride very fast, but this just accelerates so fast. I'm like, I think I might end up going too fast. And I think you should probably wear a helmet with this one. Oh! Okay, so I'm gonna get back on the XR now see how much of a difference there is oh see that did you notice that right away you can feel the motor like they kick in, in yeah and it's a little bit louder okay this feels much rougher now okay check this out I didn't actually know this until now they rounded this wheel off this one's much more like flat like a go-kart tire this is more like rounded off and that makes it much more carvy kind of like you're on snow and powder it's like oh yeah <laughs> First of all, yeah, this turns way faster. This is like, like kind of like in between a pint and the XR, where a pint is like really zippy. This is much more than the XR. Cool. Yeah, these are, these things are really cool. You should try them. No, I should. Yeah. yeah, this feels really nice. This is insane. Full honesty, I thought that there would be like very minor differences and I would be like, you're fine with XR. But there's actually a really big difference between these two. Is it your turn? <laughs> Do you know you... my face for a second from like this? Whoa, I'm so good at this. <laughs> Wait, like, what are these shoes? You didn't tell these? me that was gonna be what? Those are not one wheel appropriate My, they're shoes. They're Air Jerusalem. <laughs> I go. So I do not recommend that. Uh, nope. Just, there you go. There you go. There you go. Easy. Now chill. Just like you're standing on normal ground. Just relax. Does it automatically balance? Yeah. Really? You don't have to do anything. You're just standing on normal ground. If you want to go forwards, you just lean Whoa. forwards. I'm not liable for anything that happens to Isaac. <laughs> There we go. How's it feeling? Not good. <laughs> not good. Let's see if we can make this turn. Turning is the hardest part. 
Oh, he pulls through. Oh! I didn't have faith. I didn't have faith. I knew I hired him for a reason. Don't go too, don't, don't go too fast. Don't, don't get overconfident now. Every single person I, I, I know that has a one wheel has had one big crash because they get over, overconfident. And you did the cardinal sin of hopping off. You don't mind me asking, guys? You just, oh, uh, sorry. it's just got electric motors inside and then it balances. Try that one. I'll try as soon try as I can because I'm actually terrified and I've rode a rift stick and a few other ones. <laughs> Let me see this side. Like I said, you're more than welcome to laugh and take my phone. Ah, no, no. <laughs> yeah, my phone. For you, too. If you need to do, uh, so when you need to jump off, jump off both feet. Wow. Jump off both feet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. Nice dog you got. <laughs> <laughs> you know you want to play Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go. <laughs> you know you that was a nice guy. I always love showing the one wheel to people for the first time. You should just let him do the review. That was, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's better yeah, than we could yeah. ever do. Hey, you seem to be uh, no, I'm not. more confident. <laughs> I want to go. Feeling whoa, good? Whoa, whoa. <laughs> yeah. Maybe you stay on the sidewalk just to be safe. It's not dangerous. Get off the road, man. <laughs> what are you doing on the road? One wheels just read fun. If you ever buy any electric vehicle thing device for just pure fun, the one wheel is the absolute best. I've been riding these for a good few years now and it never gets old. It's just fun. Are you enjoying it yet? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> like this is Feeling good? Oh. Oh, you take it easy, take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> Almost going off-roading in the mud. Crocs. They don't have. He was really trying hard they don't <laughs> to have stay the out of the, on the back. <laughs> Running in the clogs. <laughs> First curb hop. Oh! Whoa. <laughs> you under curb hop? No. <laughs> I thought you were gonna go for it. I don't think you should. I don't, I don't think you should. I don't think you should. This is so satisfying. It's just. It's so smooth. Right away, notice the difference. Night and day getting on the GT versus the XR. I'm not just typing it up. I came in skeptical just like you did. But uh, there's a big difference. Let's go to the office and I'll talk about more, more of the differences. Jeremy. Thank you, sir. Okay, so I think what most of us are curious about is how does it stack up against the XR? The XR has been incredible. It's so fun to ride. Can the GT be any better? Well, first off, let's just start off with like the looks of it. This now looks like a legit product, whereas this looks more like you made it yourself. I literally get asked every single time I ride it, did you make that yourself? No, I'm not a genius. This. I don't think people are gonna be asking if I made this myself. This looks very legit. It's got the light here to tell you how much battery you have. That's really nice. And I think the biggest difference is these new pads. These are really grippy and I love that they're concave on both sides. It really changes the way you ride this thing. And then the wheel. The wheel is curved and so it's much more like curvy, maneuvery, crazy at times. And so that, it, that can be a downside for some people. For example, my brother, he commutes a lot with his one wheel. I feel like this might get a little squirrely at times, which might not be as fun for like a commute. Whereas the, the flatter wheel is a little bit more stable and straight. But anytime you want to turn or go do some trails or anything like that, this is way more fun. Okay, I haven't done any trails yet on this, but I know it's going to be more fun. Isaac, I'm so out of breath. Are you out of breath? <laughs> So in terms of riding, it feels very different. From that first, like, engaging the motors, right away you're like, okay, this is different. I don't know if it's just they've refined the, the algorithms of how it works, or it's just the stronger motor. We now have not just two horsepower, we have 
three horsepower. <laughs> yeah, doesn't sound like much, but it makes a big difference. More range, 52 kilometers on a single charge. Again, that makes a big difference. Me and my brother have wanted to go to the cottage on the one wheels, but there's one stretch where there's nowhere to charge and it's longer than what the XR could do. This thing, we could actually do a road trip to the cottage on the one wheels. Then top speed, 20 miles per hour. You definitely notice the difference. I don't know if, if I had an XR and I'm like, should I just upgrade just for the heck of it? Maybe not, but if you're looking for a one wheel, this thing is it. I love the pints, they're fun, but this, to do all the trails and actually ride it hard, this is incredible. Well done, one wheel. I didn't think you guys could actually make it this much better. It's nice. Would you buy a one wheel? If you if you buy for me, I will buy. It. How much is it? Two thousand two hundred dollars. Oh, pff. I just work for you for another year, and I'll save up. The money. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Forget marrying your girlfriend. Just that's way better. Too far. No. <laughs> so yeah, Isaac has been hired. He'll be around um, for as long as as long as I deem fit. <laughs> yeah. Do you want some animal clothes? We got a new shipment. I have the one you wore. <laughs> The sweaty one, <laughs> that's the one you want. So yeah, Isaac is the hire. Uh, I might be also still hiring some other people. We'll see, let's let's see what happens. But first we'll start off with Isaac. Isaac is a good guy. Okay, that's it. My review of the GT, very fun. Now I gotta go home, pack. It's time to go to Saudi Arabia.